today I need to make a couple of new uh, non-stick bushings for doing up CA finishes. I made up these two a while back. I think this one I actually bought, and then this one is one that I made off of the same block. Uh, these are just uh, HDPE, and uh, what you do is I, I've got a three-quarter inch HDPE that I bought a long time ago for another project, and then cut a quarter inch or a three-quarter inch section off of that. Drill a one-quarter inch hole, and then that allows you to fit it on a standard mandrel. I loaded up a couple of seven millimeter bushings on here just to give me a little bit of step off from my uh, my head and tail uh, stocks here, and then I will uh, cut a couple of cones. Probably only get two or three out of this size. Uh, it's only about two inches long. It's just a piece of scrap I had left over, but we'll get this turned up. Start out just by turning it around. I'm going to use my skew just to give me my profiles. Into that. Well, it's nice to see that I was wrong about how many I was going to get. Looks like I might get four or five. There we go. That one is all the way through. Tighten that up a little bit. All right, so I've got one that's going to be a double, and then I've got two end caps here. And then I went through, and I kind of give a little bevel to the back side just to clean them up a little bit. And those should be ready to go. Let's go ahead and pull them off here. And there's all of them together. So it wasn't a bad, bad waste of a nice piece of three-quarter inch HDPE. Ended up with uh, four separate pieces one double drum which i could have split into five separate pieces but i think that double drum will be helpful especially for the one i'm doing right now that has a, a cap and a body so yeah that's all it takes real simple and here's how i have that actually set up in action ready to do a ca finish so this is that large one that i had here's that double band and then this is actually that super small one we get this ca finish done real super simple to make those up Really inexpensive. You don't have to go spend them, uh, the money in stores. If you find a uh, like a tap plastics or a uh, shop near you, you can easily buy scrap pieces of HDPE for next to nothing. Or you can even melt down your own milk jugs uh, in the oven and then uh, press those into a block and make your own. It's real super simple.